Heartbroken Kate Garraway has admitted her husband Derek Draper is often unable to move, while she will see tears rolling down his face. Kate Garraway, 55, has described how her husband Derek Draper, 55, has become trapped in his own body. The former lobbyist, who suffers from a severe form of long COVID, spent over a year in hospital after first being rushed in back in 2020 and has been struggling with his health ever since. Good Morning Britain presenter Kate opened up about the long-term impacts COVID has had on Derek's body in a heart-wrenching new interview. She described how her husband will sometimes lie in bed with tears rolling down his face as he desperately struggles to move and speak. Derek is trapped, but he fights on. We cling on to the good days, she said. Every day is a roller coaster. The mother of two continued in reference to her family's day-to-day -day following Derek's life-changing illness. Derek's spirit fluctuates. Sometimes he lies there, unable to move, with tears rolling down his face and it is heartbreaking. But if it's hard for us, I cannot imagine how hard it must be for him, she added in her interview with The Sun. Kate has been caring for Derek ever since he entered hospital back in March 2020, where he was placed on a ventilator and put in an induced coma. During that terrifying time, Kate and their children Darcy, 16, and Billy, 13, were unable to visit him due to strict lockdown rules. Kate also revealed that she has been forced to foot sky-high bills for Derek's potentially life-changing medical trials in Mexico, and for his continued care in the UK. She also clarified that, in spite of her GMB fame, she has no ability to skip NHS waiting lists and has to patiently wait like everyone else. Kate felt compelled to speak out following the rumors that have circulated about her being prioritized since her husband became ill. Perhaps there is the assumption that because I'm on the telly, And because people have heard so much of Derek's story, that we've had special treatment from the NHS or bypassed waiting lists, she said to the publication. She then adamantly continued that her family, haven't jumped any queues, and that it is, as it should be. She added that it has been extremely tough, financially, even as she awaits referrals from three years earlier. Derek is now confined to his bed and makes use of a wheelchair, as he is still unable to walk in his condition. He receives round-the-clock care from a dedicated team of professionals, one of whom Kate paid special tribute to last month. In a picture she shared to social media in February, Derek could be seen sitting up in bed in the family's London home and smiling at his carer, Jake, who was holding his hand. Many of you will remember Jake who cared for Derek when he first came out of hospital in April 21st from the documentary Hashtag Caring for Derek, Kate wrote. So you will know what a wonderful healthcare professional he is, the continued in the picture caption. But have just found out he's also an amazing musician, under the name at sensimiller.x, she added, tagging the carer's account. He's just released a song called Hashtag Akukuseku, check it out in his bio. Kate continued, which no surprise is full of love and inspiration to keep going and never give up. The world of carers never fails to surprise me with their depths of talent, thoughtfulness and motivation. Hashtag Happy Friday all. She signed off with a heart emoji.